Yeah. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Big E, man. Hey, it's early in the morning, man. What time is it? Well, I'm a little late, man. It's 6 18. Yeah, you see the Apple Watch. Yeah. But anyway, man, 6 18. We about to crank that big white freight line up, man. It's cold out here this morning. You see Big Blue over there. This is where I parked the truck at. Hey, hey, it's cold, y'all. Cold. Can't even stick the key in the hole right now, man. Hey, but we finna let this thing get warmed up. Oh yeah, cut the heater on, full blare. Oh yeah, I'm gonna walk around, check my tires, make sure everything's good. And man, I'm gonna get back with y'all, peace. morning grind y'all let's get it baby you know what time it is we longing man it's cold in morning y'all man it's cold see what's check the temperature man what, what's going on man, let me see 43 degrees man it's pretty cold down here in mississippi now especially some parts of mississippi i don't know how y'all rocking up in the north but it's cold down here right now anyway man i got the heater getting ready to get warmed up Truck ain't been cropped in about two days. So, you know, we want to make sure you get, it gets warmed up pretty good before I even take off. You know what I'm saying? You got to take care of your ride. And what I tell you, take care of your ride, your ride will take care of you. But, man, uh, what is today? Thursday? Thursday morning? Um, thankful Thursday. Yeah, what's up, y'all? What you thankful for, man? Tell, somebody tell me what you thankful for. Man, I can tell you right now, I'm thankful that. God saved my life. I know y'all don't know my life story, but I've been shot. I've been drug dealing. I've supposed to be in jail for some of the stuff that I can't even speak on that I've done in my life because I never wanted to come back home. But man, I've done some bad, terrible things before God saved my life. And I just want to say I'm so thankful for the blood of Jesus Christ that who came and died for my sins now. Somebody that who knew no sin became my sin. Man, come on. And if you don't love, and I know we got people saying, well, <coughs> this Jesus stuff is make-believe and the Bible has, was written by white men and all this kind of stuff. Let me, let me clear this space right now. I do not care if Jesus, God, have no heaven or hell to put me in when I when I when I'm dead and gone. Judgment they come. I don't care if you have no heaven or hell to put me in. Living my life the way the Bible tells me to live makes me feel so much better every day, and it makes me a better person. So even if there's no reward for living the life as Jesus, living the life as a Christian. And when we die and go to hell, there's no heaven or hell. I don't care because I know when I'm dead and gone, the Bible says to be absent from the body is to be present with the Lord. But anyway, man, I'm telling y'all, I love Jesus. I'm thankful for all the things he's done. You know, I, you, you already know I'm thankful for, for my family, for, for number one. But man, uh, I'm just, I'm, I'm just, man, I'm just overwhelmed. And, and I heard, I hear people say it all the time. When I look back, <coughs> excuse me, when I look back over my life and see all the things that he done, you be like, man, all the stuff. I was a bad person. I wasn't. I mean, I was fit for nobody. I wasn't even fit for myself. I didn't even believe in Jesus. When my grandmother died unexpectedly. I blamed God and I knew then right then that I, I, I didn't believe in her no more. That's my wife, she'll tell you. She called me, me and my wife been together since ninth grade. My ninth grade. She she grew up in church. My wife can tell you the, the growth she seen from me to becoming from a person that did not believe in God to be, becoming a pastor. I, me and my wife started our church out of our own living room. Grew it 
to where we was able to get a building and was and was moving doing ministry for like two years before we had the opportunity to merge our church with another church and you know what i'm saying and that's that's just a whole other story right there but for her to see the growth that god had done in my life oh you, you didn't remember haters that's talking about god ain't rich man you better get back i don't want that no, that kind of energy around me you ain't fit to make me believe in what you want me to believe in i believe in what i believe in and i believe in jesus christ but man i'm i'm thankful for for i don't even thankful for y'all subscribers man um, to even just have to have me to try to think of ideas, the stuff that I can bring y'all to just to entertain y'all, man. Y'all, y'all is a big part of my life too, because I was dealing with depression, and making some YouTube videos helped me get out of it. And you know, I know we don't have a lot of subscribers. I know I'm not monetized, but man, I'm not even doing it for the for the money, money not ah, money. <laughs> I'm not even doing it for the money, y'all. We're gonna look at that low. Y'all know I stutter. But man, um, I'm just excited to see what God is getting ready to do in this next chapter in my life. Um I know that this year was kinda tough for everybody. Um and it went by pretty fast. But uh, man, I'm excited. I'm I'm so excited to walk back into ministry. Um man, I'm excited about that. I'm really excited about doing ministry again. Um because I feel like that part of me had died when I left the church that I was at. And that's been going on, going on almost three years now. And I feel like that part of me died. So I'm excited to wake that giant back up for me. And I got some words, y'all. I got so many sermons in my phone and notes that I've gotten from driving. I never listened to the radio in this truck. Never. And I listen to my AirPods and stuff, you know, my music, YouTube, stuff like that. But the amount of sermons that I've got just by driving this truck, man, it just it's it's crazy. It's crazy. But man, um, it's thankful thankful Thursday. And I just wanna tell y'all thankful for y'all. But I'm most of all I'm, I'm thankful for what Jesus has done in my life and how he saved my life. And I and I would mind sharing some of my testimony with y'all, because like I said, it's YouTube. And you know, so hey, 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 we can't talk about everything, hey. Can't talk about everything, but uh, you know, I, mean, I wouldn't mind sharing some of my testimony with y'all if that's something y'all would like to hear. So, um, man, let's check the temperatures. Man, we still we still on the climate right now. But anyway, I'm about to uh, get myself together here and uh, get ready to ride out, y'all. Peace. All right, guys, you already know. You already know what I had. That kangaroo had to get that old red bull, man. Hey, we getting ready to leave. Uh, where got me? Man, I gotta find some, some better footage, man. I really need that drone. Trying to get 
y'all good, better quality content, you know. I know sometimes I can be a little ghetto with a ratchetness, you know what I'm saying? But hey, it is what it is, y'all. Gotta use what you got sometimes. Gotta make it work, man. Sometimes all it takes is all you got. Better preach right there. But uh, it ain't too bad. It really not. But two days worth of rain. I can tell they don't grade the road a little bit. And so, and then some of it that just got hard from yesterday. They didn't rain none yesterday. So, it rained uh, the night before. So, maybe I, right, yeah. You can see how much rain is. Oh, from you already in here so far. I get up and read your app.
home to do it, we pull up here. There's a truck in there already. And uh, I can either back down on the side of him, back down on the side of him, if you look in the mirror, I can either back down on the side of him and wait for him to come out. Right about now, I think you kind of just best to wait for him to come out because I don't know how it's looking down. I may bag up, start bagging in there and get stuck. So I don't want to be in nobody way. I don't want to hold nothing up or call no other So we get ready to chill till he get ready to come out. And we're going to enjoy. We're going to enjoy this Red Bull. Got some grandma cookies. Got some. See what I got packed in my set. Got some McDonald's. Look what I got in my set, y'all. Poway, uh, got bananas, a couple drinks, you know, chips, graham crackers, you know, good stuff like that. But anyway, man, I'll um, get y'all some more footage in a minute, peace. All right, guys, we locked and loaded, as you can see. Took a while, it's nice, so now I had to um, move the load and everything, so kind of took a minute.
you know, go go like and share that page for us, man. We trying to get monetized. Uh, one of the things we want to do is buy an RV so we can travel the world. Cause man, I don't know if my wife told you guys, but we're getting ready to homeschool. Most probably all the kids, maybe I'm not sure yet. Uh, me and my wife were talking about it yesterday. Um, so we're getting ready to go that route, and see that'll give us more freedom to travel more and do more. Once we can get monetized on this channel, you know. So, hey, I appreciate it. Appreciate it. You know? but, uh, and like I said, I'm sorry about the content, the shaky content. I'm holding the phone with, with my arm. Um, with my arm. Um, I guess I, I, it's a little tripod thing. But I want to get you guys footage. And I want to continue to drop videos every day. So, okay. Until I can get me a stabilizer. It'll be nice to have a drone right now following me while I'm coming out the woods. That, that'd be nice. But, uh, I'm gonna get back with y'all tomorrow. I'm getting ready to hit the road. Well, I can just stay on. But I shouldn't have to shield for anybody. So. But that, that's what we used to be right there. Gotta stay safe, guys. Gotta stay safe. <coughs> I'm gonna put my flag on. Let me get back with y'all. Gotta tighten it. Gotta tighten it down, y'all. Right there. Alright. We got it scrapped down. Loaded. Ready to go. Hat sideways. But it is what it is.